and certainly one of everybody's favorite place to stop when they're downtown and they have a sweet tooth is Colossal Cupcakes. And today I've got Kelly Kanda from Colossal Cupcakes on with us to talk about how digital marketing fits with the cupcake world. So Kelly, thank you so much for joining us today. We appreciate it. Oh, it's a pleasure. So you've got probably the best muse in the world for images and pictures, which is the world of cupcakes. I mean, everything that you make looks so wonderful, and it kind of naturally translates to, uh, to a website as far as the visuals that you have. But tell me a little bit about how you've used digital marketing to enhance your branding for Colossal Cupcakes. I can't say enough about digital marketing. I mean, it's pretty much, I guess it's a bittersweet. To me, it's bittersweet, but it has become, I think, everything in this as far as business goes Mm -hmm. you can you can market if you have good digital marketing the sky is the limit you can go everywhere with it so um to not only have a great product that's just half of it it's about having the great digital marketing and um but for me it was about bringing those two together and making sure that it wasn't just great but they complemented one another and they really um I mean, you can only, there, as you look at our cupcakes, there's so much to them and sure. you can taste them and there's just, there's so many different elements and then we have our storefront and we have the really cool furniture. So it was about one atmosphere, one place that could sort of just bring that all together without overwhelming the product. So it's a tricky thing, but it's everything. So it's so, so, so important. I can't say enough. So bringing cupcakes to a storefront in downtown Cleveland was pretty ambitious. Tell us about how you got started with your storefront and uh, and got into the cupcake business. Oh gosh, well, I was just telling my sister yesterday. I'm like, I'm so sick of that question. <laughs> but it's true. It's it's actually it's really interesting. I was I went to school for um, television production, and I was working at my first um, job in New York City. And I would at the time I was very homesick. I went to college in Cincinnati, so I was still very close to home and. It was the cupcake craze. It was going on in New York, and it was every other corner. There was a cupcake shop, and I would go in, and I was just so overwhelmed by the amount of flavors. I'm like, well, I have to come back. I mean, I want to try this one next and this one. And it was really just different to be able to, you know, at that time, this was seven years ago. The only thing that would come close, I think, would be an ice cream shop, right? Um, where you had that amount of flavors, especially in Ohio. So I wanted to. At the time, I would go home to Cleveland, and we had nothing. We have a couple, you know, we had cupcake shops or bakeries, but you'd have to get there before 10 a.m. to have a good selection. Or we, you know, we went to one when I came home, you know, when I was working out there, and my mom and I drove to it in Rocky River, and we were so bummed because we got there at noon thinking we'll have the best selection. They had closed because they sold out, and it was just such a disappointment. So I wanted to bring, to, I wanted to come home, and I also wanted to bring that excitement and that, um, option to Cleveland where people can come in at any time of day and be able to have a huge selection and be overwhelmed with all the flavors to choose from. Um, and it's actually, I think one of the things that makes us who we are now we're open till midnight on Friday and Saturday. So we are able to offer that to the, to our clientele and that's really important to us. Yeah, it's, it's such a cool concept, the, the way that you've expanded the hours and, and kept it open so it's accessible for people. Mm-hmm. So on the digital side of things, when you sat down with your web designer to, to create your site and you had this vision in mind, what was important to you uh, when you went in to make a website in order to capture the essence of what Colossal Cupcakes is? Well, the importance to me was actually why I probably couldn't choose somebody to do it, was that I am so so particular and I am just I'm I'm I was looking up new words this morning I I can't even I don't want to say the word anal again because it's just (laughs) that's how I am when it comes to stuff so I I couldn't find the right person to do it um you know one would come out looking like a MySpace page page or the other one it would just be so much paint they would just they didn't really get my brand um, and so I ended up going with the best company ever. It's called Paragram. And they actually like would come in the store and work from there. And, you know, even when I was working meetings, they were just kind of hanging out and um, they really got to know, they got me. So it wasn't just, you know, a very general website. It was, it was, yeah. it was me, it was, it was brought into it. And that was really hard to find. And so it's an expensive it's an expensive portion of the business. I didn't just want to, I didn't actually, I didn't have a website for the first two and a half years that we were open and that's terrible. 
I have a, I had a killer Facebook page and killer social media, but no web website just because yeah. I would not settle. And so when I found Paragram, it was like such, it, it took a while, you know, again, we had to build it from pretty much nothing, but it's, it, it displays us very well, it displays me very well. And another important thing was that I wanted to be able to go on there. When I want things done, I want them done. Mm -hmm. So I didn't want to have, to, like, have a middle person that I have to wait for to put an update. I wanted to be able to get in there and, you know, throw a new flavor up or announce something when I wanted to. And so I was looking for someone that could understand that I'm not a web designer. I'm not into web development. So, you know, I needed something simple that I could go in and, you know, easily just adjust when I needed to. And so they built that for me, too. That's awesome. That's great. That's so important to be able to do it yourself. And, uh, and like you said, cut out that middleman. So that, that is very important. When I was on the site, one of the things that I thought was really cool was that you have Grubhub on the site or available and people can actually order cupcakes through Grubhub now. Is that something that you're getting a lot of traction on? What's, what's that? Is that the future of Colossal Cupcakes being able no, to it, deliver to everybody? It is crazy. Because I was just telling people, I don't even leave my apartment anymore. I have my groceries <laughs> delivered, my food delivered. And pretty soon, it's just I won't ever, I won't leave. Yeah. But yes, um, we are on every food. We're on Uber Eats. We're on Skip the Dishes. We're on Grubhub, and then we are on um, the DoorDash, which is new. Oh, and yeah. yeah, it makes it really nice because you know we used to have a minimum. It's just so hard to deliver to everyone, and so now you can go on and you get one cupcake, um, and it comes to your door within 20 minutes to an hour. And then um, cake shakes, which people in the summer, we have a line waiting for our cake shakes. People can order a cake shake now online and have it delivered right to their office or their apartment door, you know, again, from morning till night. So it's, it's, it's becoming bigger and bigger. That is so awesome. What a, what a great thing for you to be able to, to reach people. They don't even have to come to the storefront. But for people that are in the area downtown uh, to come to the storefront, tell everybody the address one time so they have it if they haven't been down there. I can't imagine anybody has been to Cleveland without stopping by your shop yet mm -hmm. because it uh, it's just so awesome to walk by and see all those cupcakes. But if they haven't, tell them where they can find you downtown, Kelly. So our main store is downtown. It's um, 528 Euclid. It's the storefront of the old arcade. And then we have another store. It's just a cupcake pickup shop. It's not a sit down, but we, we offer a variety of flavors every day there and cookies. And it's in Westlake at Crocker Park. It's right behind the Hyatt Hotel in front of the Yard House. So um, if you're on the West Side, you don't want to worry about coming downtown. Um, it's a great, we're open again seven days a week there. And you could pick up a good amount of flavors every day there. I don't think DoorDash is going to deliver cupcakes to us all the way out here in Chardon. So we'll have to wait until we're out that way to get our cupcakes. But we'll make it We'll make it happen for sure. Kelly, we want to thank you so much for joining us today on Cleveland Web Design Week. Congratulations on the terrific site. And we wish you the best of luck heading into 2019 with Colossal Cupcakes. You guys as well. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Thanks a lot. Kelly Kanda, Colossal Cupcakes. If you have not been, please go. If you're in the Cleveland area, if you're close to downtown or Westlake, man, have it delivered right to your door. You don't even have to leave anymore. But the website is awesome. Make sure you check out ColossalCupcakes.com. A great example of branding and giving the feel of the store experience in a digital platform online. So make sure you go check it out. And that's all we've got for you today. We hope that you learn more about digital marketing and cupcakes before you finish your first cup of coffee than your competition will all day. Thanks for joining us.